Okay guys, so I am at the Glor Psychiatric Hospital in St. Joe, Missouri. And super cool, when I got here, the lady asked me to pose for a picture in a straight jacket, which if I can figure out how to post that, um, I will, because that was fun. But let me be quiet. There's a lot of people here. That's the bathroom. So psychiatric hospital. This is what I wanted to check out. So Pika, so some girl swallowed all of this. They found all of this in her. Look at that. Screws, nails, bolts, beads, seeds, salt shaker tubs. they found this in her stomach like please explain this selling all the safety bins pica huh the word pica comes from the latin word for magpie bird that i said to eat almost anything i mean sometimes i crave cornstarch so maybe that's weird psychosurgery You know what trepidation is. Civil War era tool designed to relieve pressure on the brain. So they just cracked that skull right open. Phineas Gage, who is that? Despite all my rage, I am still just Phineas Gage. You can pause the video and read that. His brain's left frontal lobe was destroyed. I mean, a link between brain trauma and personality change, it seems kind of obvious. So that's what happened to Groot. You guys. This is a lobotomy. It says, Dr. Igis Moniz won the Nobel Prize for Psychology and Medicine for his success in treating a variety of mental illnesses through a surgical procedure in which he severed the fibers connecting the frontal lobe to the main body of the human brain. Lobotomy. Look at that. So he was... Look at... That's a literal lobotomy. Two hundred prefrontal lobotomies. Dang, look at that. Oh my gosh, bro. They're going straight up through there on that lady. I'm gonna chop her brain up. This is where you get a uh, uh, uh. Travel the country in his lobotomobile, performing transorbital lobotomies at mental institutions across the country. Like the fucking ice cream man. Jesus. That's like electric 
shock therapy. Miracles of brain surgery. Look, I want to throw up. Look, there's your electro shock therapy right there. Dude, I was talking to the lady. She was putting my straight jacket on, and I forgot to put deodorant on today. And I was like, "Poof!" I've been driving for two hours, and I feel like my armpits stink. <laughs> I don't know. The things I think of. Let's see. Sixty nine insulin treatments. 